Hello, I'm Catherine Palin Brinkworth, and you're watching this because you're considering using a professional speaker. I'd encourage you to do that, whether it's me or anyone else. Make sure you find somebody who's aligned with your principles and beliefs, with your values, and of course, with the people you want them to speak to. My work is primarily in the field of leadership development, whether it's in large corporations, associations, or very small businesses, in helping people to develop the confidence, the passion, the skills to communicate their message and bring their people with them in the direction that you want them to go. I also love to help people work with change management. In fact, I sometimes think of it as navigating chaos. I've had a fair bit of that in my life. So what I'd like to show you now are just a few excerpts of presentations I've given over the last few years. If you do nothing else after you leave here but bring everyone you know into a place of responsibility, you've got them as leaders above the line. It doesn't matter what your title is. You're a leader. It's someone who can imagine, inspire, influence and implement effective change. All learning, all growth, all evolution happens on the edge of chaos. And what I want the rest of you to do is think. When I go like this, I want you to think as positively and powerfully and strongly as you can. One of the most commonly asked questions in the whole of the organisational development spectrum is what is leadership? Well, I reckon it's the wrong question. The question is, what is your organisational development issue? What is your greatest challenge in your business? What is the toughest thing you have to sort out to make things better? The answer is better leadership. Do you know what I learned? It's a control strategy. It's a control strategy. It keeps you in a position of power. I'm the generous one here. You're the recipients. Grovel. <laughs> and when I go like that, I want you to think what an absolute rat that is. So I've developed three laws of leadership and they've worked for me for years. They worked for me when I was in sales management. They helped me get through all sorts of crises and they're helping me now to lead my own life, to take on the role of self-driven leadership, to also take on leadership roles in my community and I know they'll help you. The soft stuff is the hard stuff to teach and that's what business needs at the moment so I thought Catherine's message was absolutely spot on. We can all pull out one or two things to take back to our office and, and improve our businesses. We've all been winners today. And Catherine, absolutely refreshingly real. Uh, wonderful speaker, very knowledgeable but uh, usually empathetic. Think anything you want but let your thought patterns flow that way, yeah? Okay, go. You right, Robert? Everybody right? Go. So the first one, the first law, simply says this, that people are only ever capable of performing up to their level of belief. Go. Good. Okay, everybody right? Good, resist Robert. Based on the theory, that you can't fix any one thing in isolation. Does that make sense? Because everything impacts on everything else. Now whether it's belief in yourself or whether it's belief in the issue you are grasping or whether it's belief in your organisation and what you were supposed to be achieving, you had to have high level belief to get high level results. And if you only had ordinary level belief, you got ordinary results. Uh, just went listening to Catherine, it was a wonderful uh, presentation. I found it very inspiring, very insightful and I've got lots of gold nuggets to grow my business. She speaks from the heart and I think that's why she has a lot of success. A lot of inspiring ideas, thank you. Yeah. If you get a chance to see Catherine Palin Winkworth, take it. She's a great motivational speaker, she'll change the way you look at yourself and teach you how sales should be done. Catherine's presentation was absolutely fantastic. So much fresh material that I haven't heard before. Really great. I'm often used to open or close a conference, to deliver breakouts or workshops or strategic planning retreats. I'm also available for mentoring. So if you'd like your people to be inspired, informed, involved, call me or your favourite Speakers Bureau.